They recently sparked speculation that they'd rekindled their relationship after earlier reports they had taken a break. And Laura Anderson and Dane Bowers confirmed they were very much together as they packed on the PDAs on the red carpet of the National Television Awards at London's O2 Arena on Thursday. The Love Island star, 32, looked stunning in a plunging white gown as she cozied up to her singer Beau, 41, who looked dapper in a classic black tux. The 2021 National Television Awards are taking place in London's O2 Arena, and will be hosted by comedian Joel Domit for the first time. This year, more stream shows have been nominated than ever before, with Netflix period romp Bridgerton and making the best new drama list while Afterlife and Sex Education scored slots on the comedy list. It's a sin, day and normal people join Bridgerton on the new drama shortlist while Line of Duty, The Crown, Call the Midwife and Unforgotten made up the returning drama category. The drama performance category sees Line of Duty stars Adrian Dunbar, Martin Compston and Vicky McClure in contention for the prize, alongside Dolly Alexander for It's a Sin and David Tennant for Day. The NTAs have also announced a brand new category, authored documentary, which sees Kate Garraway's moving feature, Kate Garraway, finding Derek nominated for its warts and all account of her husband Derek Draper's coronavirus battle. Finding Derek has been shortlisted alongside Marcus Rashford, Feeding Britain's Children, Katie Price, Harvey and Me, Rob Burra, My Year with MND and Roman Kemp, Our Silent Emergency. Elsewhere, The Masked Singer has been nominated for its first MTA, with the madcap singing competition facing a battle with Emma Celebrity. Get Me Out of Here, RuPaul's Drag Race and Strictly Come Dancing for the Talent Show Award. Soap Summerdale, Coronation Street, EastEnders and Hollyoaks are up for Best Serial Drama. Ant and Deck bagged their 20th award nomination in a row for TV Presenter, with Piers Morgan and this morning's Holly Willoughby and Alison Hammond also in contention as well as Bradley Walsh. A quartet of standout actors are up for serial drama performance, including Coronation Street's Molly Gallagher and Sally Carmen and EastEnders' Danny Dyer not to mention Hollyoaks Billy Price. Made the cut, Line of Duty, It's a Sin and Bridgerton have made the shortlist for the forthcoming awards new host Joel recently admitted he is honored to have been selected to front the spectacle. He said in a statement, It's a huge honor to be hosting the NTAs this year. It still feels like someone has made a wonderful error. I really, really love TV and can't wait to celebrate the best stuff from what's been a very weird year or so. The comedian also joked he is hoping the masked singer will be successful on the night so he can present himself with a prize. Nominated, It's a Sin, starring Years and Years frontman Ali Alexander, Center, is up for an award, with the actor also securing a Best Drama Performance nod host with the most. The annual awards show will return to London's O2 Arena on September 9th, with Joe Domic set to host for the first time he quipped, I'm also really hoping the masked singer wins something so I can present an award to myself. That's a creative narcissist's dream. NTA's executive producer Kim Durberville added, We are so excited to be back to celebrate a remarkable TV year like no other. There is a wealth of great television to recognize and we are delighted to have Joel at the helm. With his wit and natural charisma, he'll definitely be bringing a fresh approach to this year's awards. Earlier this year, it was announced the NTAs, which usually takes place in January, had been rescheduled for September 9, due to the coronavirus pandemic. Kim said at the time, 
the NTAs will return to the O2 London in September to mark the UK's best, boldest and most beloved TV shows with a surprise-packed event, and we look forward to seeing you on the night for a celebration like no other. New Award the NTAs have also announced a brand new category, Authored Documentary, which sees Kate Garraway's moving feature, Kate Garraway, Finding Derek nominated for its warts and all account of her husband Derek Draper's coronavirus battle.